Zone Trader Pro is pleased to announce the release of a new indicator based on the exclusive Zone Trader Pro Cumulative Delta Divergence Indicator. Every Zone Trader Pro indicator is made to identify either real time information or pattern matching information or both. When the divergence indicator was created, it was meant to identify in real time the divergences occurring in the actual contracts being traded. What I wasn't expecting to find were patterns that could be traded profitably. So I was pleasantly surprised when I observed repeating patterns. These patterns were trading profitably in over 80% of the trades in this in initial test. What was also amazing is that the losses were just usually several ticks. Let's take a look at today, which is Friday, March 22nd. The S&P ended up down 54 points today, which can easily be described as a crazy day. So let's take a look at how the indicator did. There was a total of 16 trades that were indicated, and 14 of those were winners. Now, it's very important to understand how this indicator works and looks on a chart. What you are seeing on the chart is either a red or green line that matches the zigzag on the underlying Zone Trader Pro chart. The zigzag on this chart is set to 1.5, which means that you will get a zigzag every seven ticks. In other words, the minimum win is seven ticks. But what you're looking at on the chart is either a red or green line to signify a trade along with the label of no demand and no supply. But the green line doesn't start to print until you have a zigzag and then the divergence pattern begins to print. Let's take a look at this in some detail. So I've gone and I placed a black line at where you would have gotten the trade indications on each of these three trades. As you can see here, the market traded two ticks higher after the initial signal. As you can see here, the market did not trade any lower, and you would have been required to get in on a market order on this trade. And as you can see right here, again, the market traded two ticks higher after receiving the initial no demand signal. It's very common in these trades that there is very little to no adverse excursion. When the divergence pattern becomes broken, the line is going to turn black and the label changes to non-divergent. I drew a red line at where you would have first received a no supply label. And what is pretty unusual is that price traded two and a quarter points lower before becoming non-divergent. Here's the second non-divergence trade and the signal was given when the indicator became non-divergent, resulting in only a one tick loss if you'd entered in on a market order. What is also interesting about this indicator is how the market is being manipulated and we can see both signals coming in back to back where we had a winning no demand trade here followed by a winning no supply trade and then the reversal and the market trading lower. This video is just a preview of the indicator. The special divergence indicator will be released as a software update next Friday, March 29th. One of the main reasons that I coded this is that the trade can be taken automatically through the use of Bloodhound and Blackbird. The indicator is ready to be used by Bloodhound. However, Shark Indicators needs to address an issue and provide a software update before the indicator can be utilized by Bloodhound. That is the reason you're not seeing me demonstrate this with Bloodhound. The other significant update is to the divergence indicator. The divergence indicator added the capability to view the divergence signal that is no longer divergent as is illustrated here. You can see how the indicator turned dark gray on the bar that the signal became non-divergent. Before leaving, I'd like to show you one of the very unique features of the Zone Trader Pro divergence indicator. And as you can see from these series of trades right here, the signals being given were obviously pretty bearish going into this and you can see how the cumulative delta was selling off hard as the market traded sideways. Again, this is an indicator that's completely unique to Zone Trader Pro because the divergence indicator is picking up the size of the order and not the size of the fill, which is what everybody else's indicator is picking up 
and why their indicator is basically worthless. I'd like to thank you for watching this short video on the introduction of the new Zone Trader Pro Special Divergence Indicator. And if you should have any questions, please be sure to give me a call. Thanks. Have a good day.